music in the background because the last time I'm, I'm pretty sure you guys are gonna hear it but last time in the last video of my story time I seen hella comments about like change the battery change the battery you know living here I don't really hear it you know because I'm used to it and this is my mama house so like shit it better be my mama fixing it because I don't know how to work that shit but anyways so yeah guys welcome back to my channel bitches bro I haven't um look I'm fucking hyper because I just freaking drink, drink a Red Bull. Okay, yeah, you guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been what, like, over a little bit over a month since I uploaded my story time, and I have started seeing comments like, "Oh, how are you doing, girl? Like, I hope everything's okay. Like, we missed you." I, I even started getting DMs like, where people were like, "Girl, where you at? Like, you can't believe it us like this." And I'm like, "Girl, you right." But it's been it's, it's a lot going on in my life right now. Okay, guys, like. Like, and then too, like, I've been partying hella, which is not good. But there's just been a lot going on, okay? It's a lot been going on. And then after that video, when it uploaded, y'all, let me give you a freaking update. First, I want to say thank you to all my new people that are here. Thank you for showing love and subscribing, bitches. Yeah, I ain't gonna regret it. Thank you to everybody that's new and that subscribed and y'all love that video. But let me freaking tell y'all. That shit had my phone ringing like ding, 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 ding. Or, or like, oh my God, I don't even know why I'm singing. Girl, I sing like shit. But yeah, guys, oh my God, look. I had stopped, Um, I'm going to moisturize my face. This is the Glam Glow Moisturizer. That freaking video got me in trouble. Okay, why didn't it get me in trouble? Because me, Alisa Perani, doesn't give a fuck, you know? But... I was just like, damn, you know, because I shared the story time of when the, you know, the calm got stuck inside of me and shit. And uh, I received my a phone call, you know, and it was, um, it was my baby father, you know, and he was pissed, okay? Even if it wasn't him that the story time was about, he was still pissed because he was like, that shit is mad embarrassing. And then I started thinking about it. And let me be real, you guys. Like, at first, I was like, damn, like, I thought about it, and I was like, damn, that is kind of embarrassing, you know? Like, I'd be putting my business out there, but I don't give a fuck. I really don't. Like, if you know me, I don't care. Ain't no shame in my game, okay? Like, I'm just sharing stories that happened to me in my life, and, like, what the fuck that got to do with you? You know what I'm saying? And then he was like, I was like, why does it even matter if we're not even together anymore? Like, this shit was even, like, years ago, too, so, like, why does it matter? And he was like, that shit's just so embarrassing. People telling me about it, blah, 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 and I was just like what do you have me to do it's out there for a reason like people are gonna see you know bro i should have got a cojin because my ass hurts and i'm sitting on the flow i had to sit right here because i have my tv on my vanity right now so the baby could watch the tv but she's not here right now she's here with her daddy right now so it's like perfect time to film a video but yeah i just have some makeup that i'm gonna show you that i have bought and like some shein haul too right here but that's gonna be in another video because i have hella shit that i bought <sighs> so yeah but yeah you guys oh my god let me start exfoliating my lips, you guys, because they're freaking a little bit chapped, and we don't want no chapped lips over here. It's the cold time. This weather, you know, has people's lips looking dry, and that shit just doesn't, doesn't sit right with me. So I'm using this little, like, lip scrub. I got this one from the Shop Miss A store, which I have one here in Houston at the Willowbrook Mall, and I, I got the lip scrub, and I got their moisturizing mask, bro. This combo, the best. And I think they're like $2 each or something. Bro, leave my lips so good. But let me put some on. Hold on. Period. Look. I just scrubbed up all that dry skin. And I took out the little scrub. My lips look juicy, bitch. But I'm going to go ahead and apply the, the mask. Oh, wait. Not it. Note it. And you literally need a tiny bit of this one. I always carry this in my purse, like these little two combos, just in case my lips is like, you know, dehydrated or need some, they need some, bro, hello? Open up. <sighs> what the? Ugh, finally. But it looks like this, you see? It's so cute and pink, literally. And look, grab that much. This is a mask too. So it's like a thicker base and it lasts a while. Juicy. But anyways, like I was saying, I'm going to do like a little get ready with me update, whatever. I was actually going to do a story time with y'all of the time where I fought the side chick. 
but i think i'm gonna do it in a separate video y'all want me to do if y'all want me to, blah, 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 blah. Want me to do that in a separate video let me know uh, I was gonna do that story time that I said in the end of the, my last video about my video about my baby daddy fucking my best friend or my best friend fucking my baby daddy whatever which way whatever it goes they still fuck. But um, you see, I received that phone call. And he was like, "You why are you putting my business out there?" And I was like, "Sir, sir, that was my best friend and my baby daddy, which is you." So you expect me not to talk about it? Like if that doesn't include me because I fought the bitch and I fought him too? Because uh, these hands is ready to eat for everybody? But I was just like, okay, you know what? Maybe I'll save it for later because, you know, it's still a little fresh or whatever. It happened like, I think it's about to be like two years ago. Something like that. Something like that. So he was like, don't be putting my business like that's just so embarrassing. And I'm like, if you wouldn't have done it, I wouldn't have made it into a story time. But we're here now. We can't. We can't change time. So deal with it. No, but you know what? I really thought about it. Like bullshit aside, I really thought about it, and I was like, mm, y'all, let me know. Let me know. Y'all guys, let me know. Am I being too nice? Because if you don't know, the first story time that I did on him is whenever he. Uh, I did the story time of when my baby daddy broke into my car and stole my license plates, the car seat, and stuff from my car that were important to me, and I freaking. Went to his house, grabbed the keys, went inside his truck sneakily and got my shit back. And he told me he didn't have that, but he really did. He took my fucking license plate so I wouldn't be able to drive. Yeah, that shit happened like years ago. But I had the story time up. Like three, that shit had like 3,000 views already. And like he had co-workers, family, friends, everybody calling him like, what the fuck is this? Because girl, I provided screenshots, pictures, everything. Because I was like, evidence, receipts. But then, you know, I took it out because, you know, everybody was like, oh, he could get in trouble because of work and da da da. And I was like, fuck, you're right but like that was a different situation like this situation with the best friend thing like it's different you know it's not like it wasn't like that one because that one was i went in i went in that video i'm not even gonna lie because back then we used me and him used to go at it but look i know i'm giving y'all this long ass description of probably shit that y'all don't give a fuck but this is a little update of how that video went you know what i'm saying because sometimes i be wondering like let me take a shot first of all because i'm talking too much but y'all already know Y'all already know. Y'all already know. So I'm gonna tell y'all. Oh, well, I gotta tell the new subscribers. Hello, bitches. If you don't know, this is this is my shit. This is the the Gloria Margaritas limited edition, and this is the strawberry one. I really I usually like the the watermelon one, but I see that they had the strawberry one, so I was like, let me try it, you know. But guys, tell me why the fuck I went to go buy two of these at the gas station, right? Tell me why the fuck it was thirty dollars. Thirty dollars. These are usually for the big ass one. It's like fifteen dollars at like a liquor store or at Kroger's, Walmart. Like it's literally fifteen dollars for the big one. Motherfucker, finesse me. I swear to God, he finessed me because I went one time to that store, to that gas station, and I think I bought it for like eight bucks. So I paid like fourteen, fifteen dollars for two of them. Tell me why it was it was fucking thirty dollars for two of them. Little like this. I was I could have got a big ass bottle of liquor store. But I was like, whatever, whatever, dude, whatever. But yeah, I was like, y'all y'all better not be raising my the prices up on my margarita. Like, I know I put y'all on, but relax. Relax. Y'all got this bitch going up. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, but yeah, let me take a shot. Oh, baby. This is really good. Okay, and then I started seeing comments where, you know, whenever I was drinking this and y'all were like, bro, I went to go buy that shit and it's just so good. And then y'all made it into a mixed drink. I usually just drink it like this. Straight out the bottle. No mixed drink. But it's, it is a wine cocktail. No wonder I'd be having me feeling sexy and smooth and honey. This one's good. It's the limited edition one and it has 13.9 alcohol. 13.9? Oh yeah, I'm about to be fucked up after this video. Miss me, but I'm back. I'm back. I literally said I was like, January was a little trial test of still being 2021 because sheesh. And then right now we're in freaking retrograde, you guys. So, bruh, I'm just like, life is hitting me like a motherfucking train. Not even gonna lie, but shit, I've been. Oh my god. Ugh. On the other side, on the other side though, I have some exciting news, like like super super exciting. 
I'm, all I'm gonna say is me and my sister are doing big things all 2022. My sister turned 18, she quit her job at that restaurant where she was working at, and then now she works at Twin Peaks and she works on Sundays at a bar. And I'm gonna go back to stripping, guys, because I did say after the holidays and everything, I wanted to go back. So that's what I'm doing. So I'm gonna go to a club, and yes, I am filming stripper vlog videos. I just love them. But, um, yeah, so me and my sister are doing big things, and I can't wait to announce what the fuck I'm talking about. But for now, I'm gonna just keep it quiet because you know my my las vivas and evil eye is real out here. I didn't film a Christmas vlog or New Year's Eve vlog this year because, bro, tell me why I caught COVID. I got COVID, bitch. I feel like everybody and their mamas caught COVID this Christmas or last Christmas, whatever. Because ain't no way, bro. Like I wasn't even going out at the time, so I was like, how the fuck did I get it? But then again, I live with hella people, so. But yeah, so I got COVID, bitch, and tell me, I felt like shit. Like, literally, the day of fucking Christmas, I felt like shit. So I was like, bruh. Oh, no, I think by New Year's, it was already gone. But Christmas Eve and Christmas, I felt like shit. So I didn't even get ready. I didn't even film. I filmed a little bit, like, you know, just like my family opening their gifts and stuff that I got them. But other than that, I didn't even want to get off the bed. Like, I couldn't. I couldn't, bro. It was the worst. I got them. And so then bringing in the new year i was still feeling like like shit i didn't really want to do anything i didn't really want to go to work either so i was like i'm gonna wait to february because february is gonna be the start of 2022 so period i'm back no because tell me why i freaking think i got lit off just that one shot i don't know if it's because i have an a but bitch i was like let me start doing my eyeshadow on my eyeliner before i get more fucked up because then i will forget how to do my eyeliner so here we are bitches but yeah, no, I just literally did like three colors or whatever. And I'm gonna use my AOA. I don't know if you can see. My AOA Super Strip Lash Adhesive. And this is the black one, you guys. Bro, when I kid you not, this literally is like Gorilla Glue on the eyes. Like my mom, I gave them to my sister and my mom uh, whenever I bought them Christmas presents. Like I did like the little stockings and i like applied i put lashes and glue so they will stop stealing mine and tell me why they freaking hate this glue because it's so hard to take off these lashes are from shein i believe yeah oh my god i'm getting hot my face is turning red i feel it my face is hot i need to turn on the fan Girl, I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna get lit. I don't know where I left off because I was talking to homegirl. And um, I got distracted. So I was like, let me finish my makeup while I'm talking to her. You know, so I don't waste time and shit. But I did like this little simple quick glam, you know. I don't know. I'm literally not going nowhere. I'm just gonna take pictures and shit. Because I was like, I, I want to film a YouTube video. Like, I miss it. So I was like, I'm gonna just do my makeup. Fuck it, period. <sighs> and I'm drunk. Not gonna lie. I'm like, not drunk, but like tipsy. Once I get tipsy, I want to get drunker. You know what I'm saying? So, this could either go one way or the other. I don't know what else I was saying before I stopped the video. But, um, dude, it's crazy. Like, I love... I'm so thankful for y'all, you guys. Like, honestly, I'm super, 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 duper, duper thankful. Like, when I started my YouTube channel, like, what? It's been, like, six years already or so? Seven years? I don't know, somewhere around there. I wasn't, like, thinking going in, like, oh, I just want to, you know, make money and shit. Like, I genuinely love doing YouTube videos. Like, I love them. Like, I have always loved it. I wanted to do a video of like showing you guys like whenever I thought I was a YouTuber but like I never up like uploaded the videos of me being a makeup artist. You guys literally my makeup kit was like 10 mascaras you know because at the time the spidery lashes like back then was like it. Like I had like these um do you remember where I had like 250 eyeshadows like little literally like dime size eyeshadows. I know you know what I'm talking about now put a picture here somewhere but like the OG OG days like I used to do makeup videos but like I never uploaded them to Facebook I mean to Facebook to um to YouTube and then yeah I don't know I wanted to do like a reaction video to show you guys because those are like unseen videos so if y'all want to see them let me know because that would be super cool like going back and looking at my videos of whenever I was like 13, 14 thinking I was a YouTuber and shit it's crazy like 
the amount of love that y'all show me, it never goes unnoticed. Like I, every time people come up to me, they even come up to my sister at work. Like, oh my god, you're Lisa's sister. Like, it's so crazy to me. Like people really fuck with me, and I love that. Like even though I could come off as like shy in person, I really love that. Like it makes me feel like damn. Like you know, like I don't know because this is something I always knew that I was gonna do. You guys, like no bullshit. Like you can ask my family. Like everybody knew. Like I show. I try to reply to like everybody in the comments because like. You know, I should have connect to y'all in a different level and shit. And then, oh my god. And then I freaking received this one comment. Dude. No, I missed. I received this one comment where, like, the girl was, like, no shade. But, like, she looks better without makeup. Like, and honestly, I didn't, I didn't think, I didn't take that as a shade. Like, that's actually a compliment. Because, like, if you think I look better than makeup, that's, that's badass, you know? Like, that's fucking badass. But I appreciate you, girl. Like, don't, don't feel like you offended me. Because you just know that... This year is my fucking year, and I'm gonna make that shit my year. I'm gonna go fuck. I'm gonna make that shit my bitch because I'm only getting older, you know what I'm saying? I'm about to be 23 this year. Hey, girl, I gotta do something, you know? Like, I don't work no regular nine to five job. Like, bro, it's so funny because people be like, damn, like, what does she do? Because I never see her working, I never see her doing this. Like, how does she always go out? How does she always have money? Blah, blah. Like, yeah, I do realize that social media nowadays is a real job. Like, I hope y'all do realize that. It's so crazy to me that people still, like, doubt influencers and stuff. And I'm like, y'all do know that being an influencer nowadays is a real job. Like, literally, you... There's people that make it out big, you know what I'm saying? So, that's where I'm gonna be, period. Um, it's like, honestly, I always knew, like, a 9-to-5 job was never gonna be for me. And I'm so glad, like, I don't give a fuck what people say about me. I don't care what they think of me. I could never, I could never do that. Like, I could never put my business out there. I could never do that, like, da da da, -da like, OF and shit. And I'm like, girl, that's good for you. That is good for you. Everybody has their own. You know, you pick what you want to be. You do what you want to do. You do what you got to do. And that's that. I don't fucking judge nobody. If you want to do what you want to do, that's just your, that's your life. But it's just so funny how people talk shit about my shit, like, Oh, she has the only fans like, da, da, da. like that's so embarrassing especially because she's a mother like no bitch it's more embarrassing to be a bum ass mother that right here because i got fucking drunk and i still have another fucking bottle right there but i hope you guys enjoyed this video because your girl period